And I hope you understand that, you know, there's a lot to learn about piano tuning. And if you can't hear the beats, that can mess you up. Like you can't even get, I know students who just can't get through the theory because when I start talking about beats, they're like, what beats? And I'm like, well, you can hear them right now, but if, when you can in the future, when you're able to hear those beats, this is what you're gonna do with them. And people, some people are stopped dead in their tracks. They're like, uh, but I can't hear them. And they can't move on. So that's why I invented it. Because, I mean, think about it. If you're a teacher, I mean, you're a musician, maybe, maybe you're a teacher. Think of how, how hard that is to be, to have a student in front of you and you're like, you wanna help them, but they don't have the skill that you know they're gonna get eventually. If they keep working at it, but they, you know it's gonna take them time, it's going to take them time, but you also know that some of them are gonna quit. Now, some people are hard and they say, well, they're gonna quit, just let them quit. Well, I'm not like that. I'm like, people wanna learn. I don't like seeing people hanging their heads, walking away from me and shaking their heads and sadly going, I'm never gonna be able to do this. Because with this thing, hey, you could just tune the piano with this. You could be a piano tuner with this. You don't even need to develop your ear. But this thing won't help but improve your ear because you're gonna be hearing these beats constantly and then eventually you're gonna be playing the intervals you're gonna be like, well, I can hear it and I don't need this. So this is, this is what I hope that it does. I hope that people buy it and then they don't need it. Um, yeah, so that's the whole theory. That's the whole philosophy of the piano tuner's ear. And I'm glad that I could use it to show you how to tune a temperament using this so we could talk about the theory of the check notes and the coincident partials and which ones need to be faster and slower and that you could actually hear the beat rates. You could hear what I'm hearing when I tune the piano without this. So. That's it, that's the, the mini course on tuning the temperament using fourths and fifths with the help of the piano tuner's ear. And if you don't need it, great. But if you do, it's always there. Thanks for watching.